Nicki Minaj? Nicki Minaj? Yo, when they see me, they salute to have a juku. Some pink pumps, pink thumbs, and a tutu. Some pink lips, pink blush on my YouTube. Now everybody chugga lugging on my choo choo. Some bubble gum blowing bubbles, then I choo choo. Some pink toes, and my pink Jimmy choo choo. Hello guys, what are you doing? Um, so, so y'all, I will keep you posted, but you know what, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna holler at y'all later, uh, uh, do, but, um, you know, you know what I was just thinking, y'all? <laughs> like, how funny the bombs are. Like, <laughs> ah, it's it's just a it's just a cackle and a key. It's just always, you know, it's a celebration every time we link up, you know, and um, I really do love you guys. It's amazing how we started so much. you know. And, and we just really that bitch. And it, 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 some, it sometimes it still shocks me that you guys can always make me laugh, but also that y'all can always understand my little kkks. And I know that other people that be watching my tweets be like, <laughs> what? And it's not for them, okay? Now, what I want you to do is buckle your motherfucking seatbelts. See, here's the thing. And why would anybody put the link? I just told y'all if I don't announce. Now, what I want to say is that something I got wind of today. Um, man, I tell you, <laughs> it would be a bestseller. Like, I didn't even know. Like, I wonder if my mama knew when I was in her belly. That, that, that bitches would be just obsessed with Onigatanya, Mirage. And I used to be mad, but now I a cackle. It's one big motherfucking cackle. <laughs> you know, um so you know, just Just be prepared to see everything plain as day, you know. And yes, I really miss when we used to be able to talk in person and I was able to really, you know what I'm saying, gag the hoes and say, <laughs> but I think that I got, you know, Back when we used to be doing certain things and I used to be saying certain things, 
I think I was probably less famous and maybe, maybe sometimes being famous, you, you, it takes getting used to. I would imagine that being the most famous fan base on planet Earth for you guys have come with its ups and downs because you guys want to kiki, but you guys realize everybody is up your assholes and observing you all the time. And so you feel that you have to curb things and you wonder what I think when y'all um, gotta beat the dogs. And you know, I don't fault them grave. I get it. You know, so I hope that you get it. How and why, mother. But that's why we always come back when we have our new thing thing and we're on tour and I get to have that time with you guys and say things in person that I can't say on these things. But you know what I was thinking, y'all? See, sometimes I think nice Nikki or bad guy. Nice Nikki or bad guy. Nice Nikki or bad guy. And, but I think to myself, You don't need to do a thing, self. Amen. Now let the church say amen because when you trust in the Lord, the Lord does it for you. And child, if y'all only knew. But anyway, so yes, Red Ruby is that girl. Um, but the thing thing as a whole is that girl, uh, girl, like girl, uh. but anyway, so my point was that I have, I, I cannot holler at you right now. Um, about everything, but I will. And, um, And so, we gonna get where the fuck we going. Oh, yes, we gonna get where the fuck we going on the next Queen Radio. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Um, and then, it dawned on me. I think that there are other barbs, you know, that I would like to start being co-hosts with me. Um, but not to shoot each other down, but to, but to lift each other up and to applaud each other. And, and you know, that's very important. That's very, very important. Um, so I'll get into that another time, but in the meantime, I truly adore you, and I got you. Yes, I already know what I said. I already know everything that I've promised. In the meantime, I truly adore you, and I got you. Yes, I already know what I said. 
I already know everything that I've promised. Truly adore you. Everything you guys have been waiting for. And, um... But it's just funny, you know? It's just funny to see the obsession play out in real time. So now I'm going to start having a little fun with it, you know? And at the same time, the Bobs and I have always loved talking and having a good key. So, every, every key is not a key key. And do you know what I mean? But if people apply it to themselves, then that's on them. Because one thing about Onikatonia, Onikatonia don't give a motherfucking fuck a god two, three, or four fucks. I looked around in my purse today to see if I had some fucks to give, and I realized I was all out. Okay? Now. Now, from now on, the, the magic word will be beat em. When you see beat em, that's all I want you to, that's all I want to see being tweeted. The other magic word is dog. Or fleas. When you see any magic words, assemble. You'll know where I am. If I don't ask you to say where I am, don't say where I am. Because it's a secret society. Okay? You guys are epic. You guys are beautiful. You guys are very much deserving of love. And that is what you will always get from me. But it's so funny how everyone wants to duplicate the barbs, the way mother talks to the barbs, the way the barbs talk to mother, the way mother and barbs be keen. Just know that I got a lot of motherfucking gags, bitch. But sometimes you gotta fall back. And let the gagging be put to the be put to the back burner while dogs' tails get the wagon. You see, sometimes I let the dogs' tails get the wagon. Cause I know it's gonna be gagging. But you can't gag them every day. Sometimes you gotta let them tails get the wagon, pussies get the popping, booties get the juicing, and um, and oozing, and uh, uh, ultimately losing, and um, and and that's about it. So please, guys, have a smart day, and just know. Oh, no, they still duds at Ron Reup. I didn't say that's in place of duds. They, them, them, them. Okay. At it's so. At it's. Okay, Khalif. Thank you, darling. 
And also, yes, y'all, I forgot. I did pick winners last time to give out merch. So I'm going to ask one of my helpful barbs if you guys um, remember everyone that I have to send merch to or I will get Amazon to go over the show so that I can get you guys' names and then um, make sure that you get your merch. I didn't forget. Some people won on our official, last official Queen Radio, so I didn't forget. Um, but but just uh, stop, stop being used and stop being abused and stop being. Um, a part of other people's games. We play our own games on this side. You know why? It's queen things. Okay? Now, run and kill that. And don't start telling me anyone would be the perfect co-host. I'm not taking suggestions. This is what always happens while y'all start arguing amongst each other, doing things I didn't ask you guys for help on. If I said I will choose, I will choose. Because you don't know what I'm choosing it based off of. So pipe down with that. In the meantime, I give you a huge virtual hug, love, and kisses because you guys are just everything. The absolute world. Okay? So, breathe. Take a walk. Take a cold shower. Sometimes, even though it's difficult because I like taking hot showers and hot, you know, everything hot, hot, hot. But, yes. Okay, meditate. Actually, you guys, let's meditate right now. Um, breathe in. Breathe out. In through your nose. Okay, now, if there's one thing you know about the, Okay, so, y'all, what should we listen to before I get off? Everybody, what song do you want to hear before I get off? Speak calmly. Speak calmly. I want all my calm barbs to begin to put their foot down in this fan base. When they see the barbs being used by the mangy, flea infested, need, needing of medicated dogs, I want you to remember and tell the barbs, breathe. They need you. You've never needed them. That's why 
during my coronation in 2009, when I was appointed by all of the greats, all of the greats came to mother's coronation. God put me here. Praise Him. And the greats, the rap greats, before the album even came out, were present at my coronation. The fashion greats, were present at my coronation. My, 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 what a sight that was. And so today, I will be preparing for my anniversary coronation and um the rap grades and the fashion grades were there at my coronation and who else was I going to say? The magic that bestowed, that was bestowed upon my hands. And even prior to my coronation, my mixtapes. Breathe in, breathe out. You see, when you listen to the Queen's mixtapes, you can still hear the greatness, if you know what I mean. Well, when you when you have a gift, you have the gift now anybody that want to get whacked play with me Okay. But yes, there is a lot on the frontier as we take off as we board our rocket ships as we board Noah's Ark we are reminded once again that the barbs are the chosen ones we are reminded once again that when they do the queen dirty, the dirt actually bounces off the queen. 
sticks onto them and buries them in their own mental graves of torture. When people are good to you, be good to them. When they shit on you, breathe and leave and know that you are the magic. But see, the thing is, you know, okay, I can't do this right now. I got something to do. I'm going to save these things. I'm going to have everything written down in proper order on our uh, docket for the next Queen Radio. And I will alert you. I will alert you at that um, given time. Please don't ask me when it's being done. You know that I'm a busy woman. You know that I'm a mom, right? Yes. With a little two-year-old chunk who not only did he play basketball with my mango, but he's been doing lots of things. If I told if I I told him if I told the Bobs what he's been doing, uh-uh, hunty. So yes. He thinks he's grown. He tries to speak with a deep voice. He, when he wants something, he tries to have his cutesy voice. And he thinks it's funny to grab my very expensive shades and demands that I put them on him. Well, he, he makes me put them on myself over and over and over and over. And then he keeps taking them off of me and then I have to put them on him. And then he wants to have, he wants to put them on me and then by the time I say, okay, Pop, we've been playing this game now for 10 minutes. Um, he gets his little attitude and he tries to throw his little body back like, eh! and um, he constantly is is taking my things and running running off with them um the pink print perfume bottle um but nevertheless he is such a gem i'm so grateful for this little pumpkin pie and thank you for your kind words about him always. May God bless you guys and your children and your nieces and nephews as well. Um, everybody tells me that I'm like everybody's mother. Well, I don't know. I don't know. At Made Inc. kind of probably says about when did he learn how to use a phone? I was trying to. I was trying to actually delay that because for some reason I thought that. Maybe that wasn't good for kids that you know that at such a young age, but 
it's the world we live in now. And so I have to allow him to be a part of the generation that he was born into. And um, he knows how to use the phone so well that when he's using his dad's phone and I call his dad's phone, he sends me to voicemail. But he, but I'll be in the other room and I start, I, I'll hear him start going like, Oh, like, you know, like he got like somebody interrupted his game, his his thing that he watching, and I'll call back three times, and he will say, he he'll make do something with his attitude, and next thing you know, I get sent to voicemail, so he knows he knows what to press with the pop ups. He knows how to answer the phone, you know, when any, but if anyone FaceTimes us, he think he's the only one that, that they supposed to talk to. So we got to, so when people FaceTime us, we got to have a secret FaceTime. We got to hide our FaceTime calls from a two-year-old boy. It's, you know, and, and, you know, every time he finds a new word that gets people to laugh, he keeps saying it. So now he's been, you know, he walks around saying, wow, 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 all day. Yes, Papa is a very funny boy. But very sweet, very, very sweet. When you guys meet him in person, you guys will understand. He's a very sweet, loving people person. And I don't know how that happened. Nevertheless, I love you guys. So I will keep you posted on everything that, that I have to say. But sometimes, obviously, things come up. Because sometimes I might be planning to say something to you today. And I can't. Because I want to say it in the way that I want to say it. Right? So, in the meantime, know that love doesn't hurt. Don't believe that myth. Anyone that makes you cry, them. don't believe that myth. You are a perfect, beautiful human that deserves love. True love, true understanding, and true... Grace. Okay. On that note, I will holla at y'all later. DeAndre, what you doing here? Salute to have a juku Some pink pumps, pink thumbs in the tutu Some pink lips, pink blush on my YouTube Now everybody chugga again on my choo-choo Some bubble gum blowing bubbles then I choo-choo Some pink toes and my pink Jimmy choo-choos All the way in London, they love me In Australia, I'm Crocodile Dundee <laughs>